YouTube, what's going on? Justin Skaggs here from Silent Strings Across, and today we are going to review the MLL Award Heads for this season, brought to you by Brian and Warrior. This is the Die Drop. This is a really cool project, mainly because A, we love the MLL, Brian and Warrior is a great company, and of course we get to celebrate some of the best players and coaches of the year. For starters, John Galloway got Goalie of the Year, and it's completely obviously warranted. We put that onto a Brian Eraser too. The Hounds coach, Jim Stagnita, won Coach of the Year, and we put that onto an RP3 too. Uh, the Hounds logo is just something I always really liked. Uh, I, I just think it's a really cool logo, and they did a great job at that, so putting that on a head is always fun. Frank did all of these die jobs, and Van O'Banion strung all these sticks. They absolutely killed it. We had a tight time frame, and I'm really happy with how they all came. The defensive play of the year was something really cool, it was actually a tie. Joel White and Mike Manley won this year and they both played for the Rattlers, so their die jobs are very similar, however we had to put the names in different places because the head didn't really warrant that we made two identical. One of them's on a Regulator Max, which is the new head coming out from Warrior, and the other one's on an Evo 4. Lastly, completely deserved, Rob Pinnell, congratulations on Offensive Player of the Year, and we put that onto an Evo 4 as well, with the Lizards logo. Probably the most impressive color scheme just because of the neon green, and Frank really did a nice saturation on that, and it pops through the black. So overall, an awesome project, really, really stoked on this, and obviously, who wouldn't be excited to make the awards for the MLL? Thank you guys for involving us. Thank you, Brian and Warrior, for sponsoring these awards. And congratulations to all the winners. Till next time, guys, take care. Keep laxing.